Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. We've got something very different as you can see today. Now I was in the city of Litchfield last weekend and I was going into one of the little quirky shops and they had a whole stand full of these rather cool clock designs. This one wasn't on there. They did some other ones with like telephones and all that. Very weird, very arty kind of clocks and basically I took a note of the design, that's Bad Dog Designs, and looked on the website, seen the owner was called Paul, and said, you know, emailed him, any chance I can get hold of one for the channel to review and keep, keep in the background here, because I think it will just look so cool and a little bit different. And to be fair, he was absolutely, what a nice guy, I just said, yeah, why don't you pop over? So I got to meet him and his wife, who were super nice people, and um, he just said, have a look, see which ones you like. And to be fair, this, um, entry level model, the mini desktop uh, Mark II, perfect because it can fit up on the side here or, or underneath there. I'm not quite sure where I'm going to put it, but it's going to stay on the channel. So it's just something a little bit different. Now, some of the ones he actually had in his house were simply breathtakingly gorgeous. They are true art. Now, the whole thing which makes these ones special is obviously these Nixon tubes here. Now, what they are are sealed units full of neon gas and cathodes in the shape of numbers. And when a certain voltage is passed through, that one will light up and I think they look great. It will also do the date um, and you can scroll through. As you've seen a second ago, every so often it will go through all the numbers so you don't get any burnout or I think it said they actually, you know, the gas can stick or whatever. So I'm, I'm not an electrical engineer like uh, Paul, but they just look so cool. Simple to set the time on and then there's more options and you can do a whole host of things like change background colors and all this kind of stuff. But he was showing me around his workshop and he's got some absolutely amazing kind of sort of like early 50s, um, 60s kind of kind of retro um, instruments of the day. So a lot of radio stuff. A lot of um, also stuff from planes like the Harrier Jump Jet and the Tornado ID, uh, the Tornado and these kind of weird and wonderful things, which I just loved it. I just think it's a cool piece of titanium. Now, and he's got all these wonderful designs he comes up with. So if you're in the market for kind of a weird and funky clock, please check out his website. I'll leave it pinned in the description and I'll put it on screen now. Some of his designs are well worth it. I can strongly recommend talking to the guy. He's so knowledgeable, super interesting, and well worth getting in touch with. So anyway, all the best, guys, and most importantly, stay safe out there.